If you are looking for a place to live near Garden Grove, it is very important that you choose the right city. And today in the video you will see the 10 worst suburbs of Garden Grove for 2023. So subscribe to the channel and let's go to the video. 10. Pomona. Rounding out the 10 worst Garden Grove suburbs to call home is Pomona. Located 22.4 miles outside the city, Pomona's is a real pit when you look at the data. Its residents have the 32nd highest unemployment rate, 6.29%, and poverty is far above the area average. 9. Maywood. If you absolutely have to live near Garden Grove, then Maywood might be a place for you to consider as it's only the ninth worst Garden Grove suburb. About 6.81% of residents are out of work. Another big problem is crime, which is getting worse every day. Maywood also has a high rate of school dropouts. 8. Bell. Bell is a city about 18.7 miles from Garden Grove, but Garden Grove probably wishes it was further away. It ranks as the 8th worst burb for 2018. You'd be hard-pressed to find a worse place to live. Bell has the 12th most uninsured people, 5th worst incomes, and has the 8th highest unemployment rate, 7.63%, in the entire Garden Grove metro area. Homes only cost $436,400 for a reason. That's cheap for Garden Grove standards. 7. Linwood. You rank as the seventh worst place to live around Garden Grove. Many residents are leaving Linwood for more opportunities elsewhere. It's the place with the second most out-of-work residents in the Garden Grove metro area. 9.68%. 6. Bell Gardens. Bell Gardens has 41,770 residents who probably know it's a pretty bad place to live. The biggest problems are unemployment and crime that has grown a lot in the pandemic. If you want to have fun in Bell Gardens, forget that there is nothing interesting, you will be very bored living there. And the more time passes, the more the poverty rate increases and more homeless people appear on the streets. 5. Montclair. Montclair has the distinction of being a Garden Grove suburb. Which means that's about all it has going for it. All snarkiness aside, Montclair has the fifth lowest home values in the Metro Garden Grove area where the median price is $388,100. To put that into perspective, in Hermosa Beach, the median income is $197,826, which is the best in the area. Montclair has an unemployment rate of 7.21%, which ranks 12th worst. 4. Compton. If you live in Compton, most likely you struggle to make ends meet every month. It ranks as the 16th lowest Garden Grove suburb when it comes to residents making money. Not only that, but this is the third worst unemployed suburb you can live in if you choose to live near Garden Grove. Compton is about 17.3 miles to downtown. 3. Cudahy. Back up the highway we go for the third worst Garden Grove suburb you can live in. You might have expected to see Cudahy on here. While the cost of living is low, your entertainment and work options are limited. And that's an understatement. In terms of numbers, it's in the worst 15% for insurance, and the adult high school dropout rate is poor compared to other Garden Grove suburbs but at least there are nice parks to bring the kids during the day. 2. Commerce. Welcome to Commerce. Home to Kmart, Big Lots, and a lot of gas stations. This city is 18.4 miles to Garden Grove. Income levels here are the 10th lowest in the metro area, 
where families bring in about $54,639 a year, which doesn't go a long ways even on a shoestring budget. Another problem is the lack of jobs and opportunities. But on the bright side, there are a lot of fast food joints in the area. 1. Huntington Park We'll get the ball rolling with Huntington Park, the absolute worst place to live around Garden Grove according to the data. And in the world of worst rankings, Huntington Park beat the competition pretty handily thanks to scoring in the bottom 15% in three major categories. Income is the fourth worst in the Garden Grove area, and to make matters worse, the city ranks 13th worst when it comes to home values. At least it's cheap to live there. But there's a reason for that. It's Huntington Park. You won't feel bad about not having a great income for the area. There aren't a bunch of places to spend your money anyway. I hope the video was very useful for you. If you have any doubts, leave them below in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.